morning, good morning. You know what I'm saying? Squad up, you heard? So, uh, we had a long talk, me and the team. It looked like your boy gonna be getting the music thing going, like, like real serious. Um, everybody's thinking about relocating to Austin, Texas. Um, they really want me to hurry up and do what I have to do. Uh, and then just relocate to Austin, Texas and be away from people with bipolarism and BS. So it's a real thought process now. Like, it's a real, real thought process that Austin, Texas may be the move. Um, there's more money to be made in Austin. Granted, traffic is horrible, but it's a real thought process to move to Austin. Um, and then they brought up something that was crazy to me. They're like, bro, you know, it's time for you to, you know, get married. And because all of them are like in like long-term committed relationships, my, except for LJ. LJ's relationship is kind of new. But he has a baby already with her, so. But we're, we're, we want to do like couples group, like couples retreats and couples uh, getaways. Like we won't hang with people who are single, basically what we're saying. So we want to do like a couple getaway, uh, New York, Miami. We already we already planned out New York, Miami, and Vegas for next year. Um, hey. It's time, man. It's time. Um, they saw how... They, we actually sat down and talked about what was stressing me out the most. And I, we had a positive feedback session. We don't like call it arguing or debating. We call it a positive feedback session because you, you say what's bothering you and, like, how can you fix it? And some things, like, they, like, they clearly pointed out to me is, like, you have no control over that. Sometimes people are just going to be the way they are. You just got to let it go. You know what I'm saying? And you can't force feed love. You have to let it happen naturally, organically. Um, we're all going to start back working out and everything. And the one thing that I took out of yesterday was when I heard, boss, you have to understand, like, in order to be happy with somebody else, both have to be happy with yourself. I think that was the most logical thing I took out of it last night. Um, and those are my those are my friends, man. Like they really, really got on me. And I couldn't say anything. I had to just take whatever they were gonna say. But in all actuality, like I think I can accept love a little differently now, a little better. Because now I know what to do with it once I open my eyes to it. Um, you can't really hold anybody accountable for your past mistakes as far as people doing you dirty. So, or even what you did to other people. You just have to now hit the reset button on it and move forward. Boss.